A woman nearly half a century ago pleaded not guilty to murder. He's already serving a sentence for another crime. Stephen Ray Simpson was indicted in connection to the death of Valerie Warshe. She was killed in 1978. She was a California park ranger visiting the Big Island. Her body was found at the Harry K. Brown Park in Kalapana. Simpson's currently being held on $250,000 bail and is already serving a lifetime sentence for another murder back in 1979. His trial for this current case is scheduled for November 14th. Officers on the Garden Isle are searching for this woman accused of stealing from a home in Lihue. The Kauai Police Department today released these shots from surveillance video captured on June 13th. The woman allegedly entered a carport on Fujii Street and stole several things, including gas cans and yard tools, including a leaf blower. If you have any information about the suspect, you're asked to call Kauai Police at 241-1711. That number is up on your screen. Back on Oahu, the man who robbed the 7-Eleven store this morning is still on the loose, and we first told you about this on Good Morning Hawaii. It happened at this 7-Eleven in Kalihi at around 2 o'clock this morning. Police say the suspect held the worker up at gunpoint and demanded money. He then took off with cash. The worker was not injured. Call police if you have any information that can help investigators with this case. Over on the Big Island, police are searching for 41-year-old Jennifer Michelle Schoen, seen here. She's reported missing. Her family hasn't seen or heard from her in several days. Police say Schoen lives in the Hawaiian Shores subdivision of Pahoa. She's 5'7", about 150 pounds. If you see her or if you know where she's at, call police at 935-3311. Happening right now, Big Island firefighters are battling a brush fire in the Ka'u area. Take a look at this video. You can see some of the flames along with the scorched grass and trees. Hawaii County reported the fire broke out just around 2.45 this afternoon in the Discovery Harbor subdivision. Drivers are being asked to avoid Wakea and Kahiki streets. There are no reports of any injuries or damage at this time. Meanwhile on Maui, roads are back open tonight after a brush fire broke out in Lahaina. Maui County reports the blaze started at around 3 o'clock this afternoon at the corner of Hokiokio Place and Lahaina Bypass. Firefighters put out the fire about an hour later. The road reopened shortly after. The fire burned about 